Hi, beloveds. Welcome back to Weekly Inspiration with me, your host, Tanya Melendez. Today is September 15, 2014, and we are in the middle now, completely smack dab in the middle of September. And so what that means is we are getting ready for fall. And what better way than to, like kids are going back to school, for you to get back in school as well. I'm so excited to tell you all about my new program, Soulful Solutions, Everyday Spirituality. I'll share with you. Um, the intro week sign up we do start next week but before we go any further I want to share with you today we will be using the angel therapy cards as well as our message from the tarot so let's go ahead as we always do starting with our prayer so go ahead and put your hands in that prayerful mudra close your eyes and take a nice deep breath allowing yourself to connect to the divine connect to your inner self and it is in this moment that I know I am one with the one that is the one. It is in this moment that I know that good, grace, and gratitude surround me and are me. And as I know that good, grace, and gratitude surround me, I absolutely know for everyone listening and watching that good, grace, and gratitude surround you. So I bless our week. I call it good, call it great, call it graceful and grateful. And as I bless our week, I bless our body temples, knowing that we are whole, healthy, and complete. Our bodies are vibrant. They are vibrating good grace and gratitude. So I give thanks to the body, to my body, as you give thanks to your body. And as I bless our body temples, I also bless our homes, our dwellings, where we lay our head, including our pets and even our plants. I bless the entire dwelling that we are in, no matter if it is a home, an apartment, a room, whatever it is, it is blessed. And in blessing our homes, I also bless our modes of transportation, be car, bus, train, our feet, whatever. I bless our modes of transportation. And as I bless our modes of transportation, I absolutely also bless our work, what it is here that we do and what we are here to do. So I bless it, calling it good. And as I bless our work, I bless our abundance and our prosperity, knowing that we grow and flow every single day more and more into the what is our prosperity and how we receive it. I am just so grateful for this prayer, so grateful to speak these words and so blessed to do what I am being called forth to do. So I just release these words, release this prayer, release any fear, doubt, worry, and anything that is holding you back from the, from your highest and best. I just release it now. I let it go. I uncoil, unhold, undo, un allow anything that is based in fear to be undone now. I release these words knowing that there is only good, there is only grace, and there is only gratitude surrounding us, filling us, and is us. How good it is to know this, how good it is to speak these words, how good it is to know. I release and let go and let God and let life. And so it is. Amen, amen, amen. All right. So I was feeling that prayer. As I always do, I'm always so grateful to pray with you. And if you would really like to learn how I do the prayer, the spiritual mind treatment that is a part of the science of mind, that's one of the things that you will be learning how to do in the Everyday Spirituality Soulful Solutions program, which I will tell you a little bit more after we pick our cards. And you can see, it's if you've watched my videos, if you've followed me for a while now, you know that I pray every single time. And it's in that prayer that it came to me that it was time for me to share all of the things that I do as a spiritual practitioner, as a spiritual person, as a spiritual teacher, as a spiritual healer, as a spiritual counselor. How did I get here? That's what 
soulful solutions is all about it's about that everyday spirituality and how you can have and how you can be a spiritual person every single day it doesn't mean you have to go to church it doesn't mean you have to do anything else but allow yourself to be spiritual and so wow so the card that we got is speaking exactly to that we get manifestation power what are you manifesting right now and what this card says is use your spiritual gifts and natural abilities to attract your desired outcome what are you putting your attention and intention in right now that is what you are manifesting so mind your mind be aware of what you're doing, what you're thinking, what you're saying. Be very mindful at this time because what you think about, you bring about. And that's what this card is saying. One of my favorite things that I practice myself personally is pay attention to yourself. Are you thinking positive thoughts or are you being judgmental? Are you thinking negative thoughts or are you thinking loving thoughts? That is what the everyday spirituality soulful solutions will show you how to do the same things that I use for myself and the same things that I use for all of my clients will now be right there for you every single day so manifestation power so let's see what the tarot have to say since we're already on a roll the angels have spoken and so I'm going to say the prayer that I always say for the card. So earth, water, fire, air, guide us to what we must share. Allow us to know, see, feel, hear, and understand your divine wisdom and your divine guidance. I call forth the angels, the archangels, the ascended masters, the goddesses and the gods, the fairies and the elementals. Please guide us to know what it is we need to know now with the tarot. And so it is. So I'm a little under the weather. The weather here in Chicago changed overnight. Last Monday I was in shorts. This week I'm in a sweater. It's cold. So I'm heading on out back to Florida. So excuse me. <clears throat> I did wake up with a little bit of a scratch, but let's see what the tarot have to say. So first card is the Eight of Rods. Rods represent fire and spirit. And what this card is telling me is that you have already laid the foundation. You have already said yes. Now it's time to come home to yourself. Remember, listen to what your spirit is saying. Let allow and align and you know one of the things that I want to share with you is what spiritual practice is. You know how an Olympian they they train for weeks, for months, for years even to be the best at what it is that they're here to do. And that's what Soulful Solutions is for you. It's an everyday spiritual practice. It's learning how to practice the practice of being spiritual. And what really stuck out for me and what I'm really picking up with this card is what I share in everything that I do. Spiritual practice is really about the acceptance, the allowing, and the alignment of yourself and the God of your understanding. That's all spirituality is, connecting to you and the God of your understanding. So let me show you how to do that. And, you know, I want to let you know, even... I know I keep getting excited and talking about it. I want to let you know that I'm doing this because I was guided to do this. Because so many people ask me, how can I be a spiritual person? How do I, you know, move from, from fear to faith? And that's really what this is all about. But again, I'm getting ahead of myself because I'm so excited and I want to share it with you. So the devil card is our second card. And so what this card is telling me, it's time to let go of the past. And I love that we got this card too because, again, we think mistakes are failures. And you know what? Mistakes are lessons. You know, if we can replace the word mistake for lesson or what I call a lesson, a blessed lesson, we can really allow ourselves to forgive ourselves, to heal ourselves and forgive and heal all those relationships and situations that have been holding us back. And that's what the devil card is saying. It's time. Let it go. Let it be buried. Let it stay back there in in the past where it is, where it belongs, because you were the only one holding on to the past and it's time for you to be present. Give yourself the present of being present in the now and that's what this card is telling us. And then we get the page of pentacles. Pages are our messengers and pentacles represent our, our value, our self-worth, as well as our own prosperity and abundance. How do we relate to our abundance? How do you relate to your prosperity? That's what this card is saying. Pay attention to how you're treating yourself and how you're treating your finances and prosperity. And what value are you placing on yourself 
or on your material wealth. That's what this card is. So pay attention to yourself. That is one of the other lessons I will teach you in the Soulful Solutions Everyday Spirituality. So now that we've got the cards and we know that we are manifesting, remember what you think about, you bring about. Whether it's good, bad, or ugly, you will bring it about because you're thinking about it. And I want to share something with you before... Of course, I've been telling you, I want to talk to you about the everyday um, spirituality, but I want to share with you from my Science of Mind book. You know, I've had this book for a really long time. I want to let you know, my Ernest Holmes, this is my book that I learned, I, you know, carried with me through my years of training as a practitioner. And what I wanted to read with you is, and if you do happen to have the book, it's on page 274, and it is in the chapter labeled Principles of Successful Living, and it says, prayer is not for the purpose of making things happen. It is to provide within ourselves an avenue which, which they may happen. And that is really the basis of why I wanted to do something that would allow you what I've used for myself to become a more spiritual person, to practice the practice of being spiritual because that is what it is. And, you know, a miracle happens the instant that you allow yourself to be in alignment. So if you're feeling this right now, this is a miracle moment. This is a miraculous experience that you're having right now because you are aligned with the truth of yourself. And that's why I pray in the videos because that is when we align, you know, and every time I have a client, the first thing we do is pray. We pray because that is aligning and that is a miracle. So finally, let me tell you a little bit about the Soulful Solutions. So and I want to share with you a little bit about my, my personal journey. But, you know, I want to dive deeper into that and what I've used and how I've used it and what's worked and what's not worked in my spiritual journey. But, you know, I can tell you my life has been up and down and my spiritual journey has been long. I've learned so much from some amazing teachers, had some amazing life experiences and some amazing life failures. And it's those failures. It's those blessings, those um, that have gotten me here. And so that's what really spiritual, um, everyday spirituality, soulful solutions is really all about. And if you want to hear more about it, I am offering a free Google Hangout this Monday, the 22nd at 8 p.m. You can find the details on my website at www.tarolifecoach.com. It's going to be 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Again, it will also be a Facebook event. So if you'd like to join, if you'd like to be in on the Google Hangout and have questions about how to sign up or things like that, go ahead and send me an email at tarolifecoach at gmail.com. And again, all the details will be on my website um, early, later, I'm sorry, later this week, www.tarolifecoach.com because that Google Hangout will give you and let you answer or um, give you all the answers and answer any questions that you have about the program because the program is going to be a weekly or monthly. And the reason I'm offering it as a weekly, in case you want to try it out. And so the intro price for this week only, from today through Friday, the 19th, is $12. So you can get a whole month for $48. The regular prices will definitely go up, but not much more. I want to make this affordable. I want to make this doable. I want you to be committed. And that's why I'm offering at such a low price because, again, this is a blessing. This is an opportunity for me to do what I love and also to share it with you. And so if you're really interested and ready to sign up, go ahead. And it is for one week, and we do start next week on the new moon, the 24th on Wednesday. Our classes will be on Wednesday. We'll do two videos a month. I'll have them pre-recorded pre for you so you can watch them at any time. There will be two new videos or Google Hangouts every week that you can have access to. There is also a bi-monthly newsletter to keep you on your practice, something that you can read, as well as a three times a week, check in, either a text message or an email. That way you are getting the practice that you need. You're getting the reminders. I'm going to remind you. I'm going to teach you. I'm going to pray with you. We're going to do this together. 
And one of the best things I can tell you in signing up with the Soulful Solutions is you will get a discount on any private sessions with me. So for more details, make sure you check out my website at www.tarotlifecoach.com. And and again, our we will have a very um, we will have a Facebook page for our community for our tribe of the. Um, everyday spirituality and soulful solutions program and that is hashtag be a prayer so the hashtag be a prayer what that really means is you're being a prayer really praying and you are a prayer and so that is hashtag be a prayer so if you're ready to start I'm ready to guide you to share with you my experiences and the experiences that I've had and I want to let you get to know me a little bit more as well so if you're interested please go ahead and you can send me an email either at tarolifecoach.com I'm sorry tarolifecoach at gmail or you can sign up for the event on Facebook, which I will be creating today. So it is going to be a free Google on Air hangout just for you to answer all your questions. And so I want to let you know this is something that I am so grateful and happy about. As well as I want to tell you with that, there will be another amazing, amazing announcement next week. I cannot wait to share it with you. I've been keeping it under my hat. But I am back to traveling this week, heading back to the Sunshine State so I can work on my tan and get out of this cold weather. And so I'm just so grateful. I'm so honored and so blessed to be sharing this with you and you know I want to let you know there are some really great things that are going to be happening and I want to let them happen with you and for you and keep you and just love you and so until next week know that you are loved you are light and you are blessed peace and blessings